What's going on guys, it's your boy CMB, back in the building, back with another video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Now, let's get into this really quickly guys. Uh, you guys know we're coming off of a big fight weekend. Uh, Canelo Alvarez, the face of boxing, uh, captures Billy Joe Saunders WBO super middleweight title guys. Uh, it was at the AT&T Stadium, over 73,000 people in attendance. I was blessed to be there. Uh, it was a huge, huge spectacle, guys. Uh, just glad to be a part of that. Had a great time out there. Met some great people out there. Now, the fallout continues uh, since the fight, guys. Uh, you guys know Demetrius Andrade crashed uh, Canelo Alvarez's press conference. Uh, they had some heated words between each, each other. Uh, Demetrius was looking for that fight, guys. And let me say this. Uh, Canelo Alvarez was speaking some of the best English I've ever heard him speak. Uh, throwing around the F-bomb, guys, like, like he was a sailor. Uh, it, it, was, it was surprising to see Canelo Alvarez speaking English and being so upset. I've, I've never seen him that way before. You're a horrible fighter. You're a horrible fighter. Uh, I was cracking up at that. But I do understand where Demetrius Andrade was coming from. Uh, but here's the thing, guys. Uh, you have all these fighters at 160, uh, four champions at 160, and I, I got a message for those champions at 160, and my message to the champions at 160 is, stop chasing Canelo. Let me repeat that. Stop chasing Canelo. If you want to fight with Canelo Alvarez, then you have to stop chasing him. You have to make yourself stand out. You have to put yourself in a position where you can't be denied by Canelo Alvarez. That is the only way that you're going to get that fight, in my opinion. Canelo Alvarez, uh, he's like the popular guy at high school. You know, he, everybody, everything gravitates around him. It might not be fair, but that's the situation that you guys are dealing with. He's the cash cow. He's the face of boxing. You know, people are going to cater to him. So you're going to have to make yourself stand out. You, you're going to have to go the hard route. Uh, Sometimes the hard route is the best route to put yourself in position. It's just as simple as that. You guys need to be fighting each other. You guys need to be fighting each other. Trying to unify. Uh, trying to become undisputed at 160. So you won't be denied. And that's the only way you're going to get this. But for some reason, these guys don't want to seem to fight each other. Uh, Triple G doesn't want to fight uh, Jamal Charlo. Jamal Charlo doesn't want to fight Demetrius Andrade. Now, I will say Triple G is trying to fight Ryota Murata, but he's only trying to fight Ryota Murata because he thinks he's the weakest link at 160. Be careful what you wish for. You guys need to mix it up. Uh, I don't understand why these guys don't want to face each other. Everybody wants to fight Canelo. So it, it's just one of those things. You all can't fight Canelo. He can't fight you all. He already has a plan. Uh, he's, he's doing what he said he was going to do. He said he was going to become undisputed at 168. He's already almost there. If he can get past Sweet Hands Caleb Plant, he's there. He started his quest back in December. One more fight and he's undisputed at 168. You guys are sitting around waiting on him to pick you, putting yourself in a subjugated position. You need to make your own lane. Like I said, that way you can't be denied by him. But as long as you put yourself in a subjugated position, he's going to sun you. And that's the and, and, and that's just the God honest truth. And uh, a lot of you guys listening to me out there right now know that. You know, life isn't fair. You know, some people are going to, have more than you some people are going to be more popular than you you know it's it's just the way it is but you have to work hard and, and you have to make your own lane and sometimes that's just the best option put yourself in a position where you can't be denied i'll say it one more time you guys at 160 need to stop ch chasing canelo alvarez and start fighting each other and maybe then your Canelo will have to face you. Whoever it may be, whoever's left standing, Canelo will have to face you. 
And that's all I got to say about that, guys. So you guys tell me what you think about this in the comments section. Uh, all these guys at 160 trying to get a fight with Canelo Alvarez. And uh, it's, to me, uh, it's just pathetic the way that the 160 uh, weight class is, has been acting. You know, 135 has been doing the same thing lately, too. So you guys tell me what you think about this in the comments section, guys. It's the CMB. I'll talk to you guys in the next one. And I'm out. Peace.